All right, so I'm going to show you how to work around the closed captioning. So down here, Zoom actually has closed captioning, but you have to plan ahead and you have to provide the um, transcript ahead of time. So what we're going to do is I am going to exit full screen. I am going to um, share my screen. And I am going to share screen three. I'm not going to turn on share computer sound or optimize for now. Share. And so my um, my video of my web conference has moved to another monitor. And so right now what you see is you see a presentation that I want to give. And so you can actually do this in PowerPoint, but I like Google Slides, so I'm going to show you how to do it in Google Slides. So at this point, you have a presentation, and although mine's only two slides, um, it's not a heavy-duty presentation. So I'm going to hit Present. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here where it says Closed Caption. And I am going to pull down the little carrot menu, menu carrot. Whoops, get back there. And I'm going to make sure that the text is on the top for now. And I am going to start talking, blah, blah, blah. And then I'm going to go back to the bottom, see if it adapts. Go right here. Check one, two, three, four. Oops, didn't turn on. There you go. I just didn't turn them on. All right, so now what I did was I turned on closed captioning on Google Slides. And if you noticed, what um, I had a little challenge with is I keep forgetting that when you pull up the menu, this has to be highlighted yellow for it to work. So if it's not highlighted yellow, you haven't selected it yet. And that's what I wasn't doing. I was picking the location, but I was not selecting closed caption. So that's what you have to do. And then so I'm going to go back to full screen. And I'm just going to let it pop up for a little bit. And so you can do a few things. You can sit there and you could talk all you want. And when you're in a webinar, or a web conference, people can read this. And then that way, if there is some minor audio challenges, they may actually be able to read what you're saying while you're giving your presentation. So you can also do this with a blank slide. So I'm going to go to a blank slide right now and just keep talking. You can actually change the size of the slide so you can try to um, fill up the screen a little bit more, but it's, it's a little wonky, so I won't show you that. But definitely, now you are in a Zoom conference. You are not using the closed captioning option in Zoom. What you are doing is you are using Google Slides, and you are using closed captioning, which is really kind of subtitles for presentations. And there you go. That's how you do it.